Worst music for a Famicom game ever in three, two, one. Oh boy, it's on Yankio Town, the first game from Pony Canyon. In case you don't know, Pony Canyon were a subsidiary of Fuji Senkei Communications Group, a media conglomerate in Japan. The subsidiary was originally created to produce music in 1966, eventually venturing into anime and in 1983, video games. Mostly for PCs before focusing more on home consoles, starting with today's charming title. But wait a second, a record subsidiary isn't a developer of games, so of course, they didn't develop it. Now looking at the quality of this game, who do you think developed it? Hmm. Terrible music, glitchy sprites, slow down. Would it be... Micronix? Yes! I got it right! I win! <laughs> oh wait, it's a Micronix game. Nobody would win. Now before we begin, what does Onyanko mean? Well, uh, I don't know. I did find this girl group called Onyanko Club who's interestingly on Pony Canyon's label. But from what I can tell, they have no correlation. According to Wikipedia, their name would translate to Kitty Club, so Onyanko is slang for cat? It would make sense. In this game, you play a mother cat whose kitten wanders into town and your incompetent parent ass must save him. But for some reason, a bunch of dogs and overalls want you dead. I'm wondering if this game is racist allegory? From the looks of things, Onyanko Town seems to be inspired by Pac-Man with its maze-like terrain and enemies you have to dodge. But please, this game is nothing like Pac-Man. Tell me, did Pac-Man ever use psychic abilities to open manhole covers to have the ghosts fall in? I think not. Seriously, that's your main form of defense in this game. Move manhole covers with your mind. I guess I gotta give Micronix points for creativity. You know what? The dogs aren't actually racist. They're just skeptical of this cat with esper abilities. Or maybe this cat's just a jerk. One thing you can do is take this random fish from a fish shop and the fish owner will come after you knife in hand. And at first collecting this fish seemed to do nothing. No speed up, no extra points, nothing but an angry fish salesman. That is, until I read the Japanese Wikipedia article, and it turns out that this fish can act as a repellent for a dog if you collect it. But it's a faulty form of defense because the fish salesman stops at nothing. That's not the only thing this cat can steal. There's dresses and shoes for her to collect for extra points. Nothing like doing a little theft while trying to save your kid. I've joked about this game enough, but seriously, this is Micronic's worst game to date. I've mentioned the slowdown, the graphical glitches, I swear I see sprites of the characters all over the screen, and the music, the music. What do I even need to say? One more thing I have to mention is how Micronics left what looks like walkable path here, but oh no, it's not, and I'm dead. Seriously, how do you mess up a maze game like this, this bad? I'll tell ya, Micronics can't. Stay clear of this one, friends, or that song will haunt you in your nightmares.